reading? Uh, Breakfast of Champions. You've been reading that book for a while. It doesn't look so thick. It's still a good book. I've seen you out here every day for the last six months with that book. It wouldn't even take Sarah Palin that long to finish it. If she could read. I'm, uh, kind of on a schedule here. I'm sorry. Are you just learning to read? Uh... I didn't mean to embarrass you. I think it's cute. Adult literacy is very sexy. I know how to read. So what's with the book? I, I'm obsessive compulsive neophobic. What? It's a fear of new things, which is kind of hard for me to accept because I just found out about it a couple of years ago. Extreme neophobia. At worst, you seem introverted. It's not a joke. You know, I heard about a cure for that. Really? Yep. Scientists recommend you try a new thing every day. Yeah, I've done that. So I started reading Breakfast of Champions five years ago. Five years ago, huh? Maybe it's time you consider switching up your routine. I don't like new things. You do the same thing every day? Yep. So what do you do around six o'clock? At exactly six o'clock, I begin to prepare my grilled cheese sandwich for dinner. You wouldn't change that for anything? I haven't changed it for anything. So what if you had a date tonight? I need to get back to my book. You need to get back to that book. Like, I need to eat dinner alone tonight. So how about... Okay. I didn't even ask you yet. Meet me at the town hall at 6 tonight. I, I, I didn't, uh... I'm thinking Chinese food. We can eat it in the park. I've never had Chinese food before. I'm really not sure about this at all. You say that like it's something exotic. It's not like I asked you to get sushi. Or octopus. Uh, I don't eat, I don't eat food with sauces. It's not really a sauce. It's more of a creamy glaze. Just try it. Oh.